So this exhibition is called Buildings Make Glasgow and we've brought together a real mixture of different artists, different styles, different mediums, um, with the main focus just being the streets of Glasgow and the beautiful buildings that we're surrounded by. So we try and do um, a lot of just different exhibitions throughout the year and we try and kind of theme around something. Usually because we have so many amazing artists, we don't like to kind of do just the one, the one artist in the exhibition. And we were just brainstorming about what we hadn't done recently, myself and Natalie, who works in the gallery, and we thought buildings around Glasgow would be a really great theme. So nearly all of our artists are local, um, especially in this exhibition, they more or less all live in Glasgow. I think we've got one artist who's in Edinburgh, apart from that, all local. I think it's just um, really nice to be able to show in a gallery space a lot of what artists are doing. So a lot of our artists, we find, um, at the moment we're finding them on things like Instagram, their own websites, you're able to showcase it so well on social media. So to put it into a gallery setting where it's more accessible for anyone to come into the gallery, you know, children can come, we're open seven days a week, so it is really kind of a welcoming space. That's what we try to do. How lucky we feel to have such an amazing city that our artists are really inspired by. Um, Karen Cairns, for example, is an architect herself, that's her day job, and she does her paintings as well as that. So for her, she's just drawn to these amazing buildings. She, actually, she was in earlier and she was dropping off her work and she gave her a really nice quote to me. Um, she said that it's the light in Glasgow that turns our city into living art, and that's what inspires her and hopefully inspires our customers.